Hello friends, welcome to the series lecture of ASC. Myself Srushti from 3rd year College of Agriculture, Vijaypur. My topic is Anistress. Let us begin the topic Anistress. Anistress. The state or interval of sexual inactivity between two periods, sexual activity in a cyclic breeding mammal. It is a principal symptom in many conditions that causes infertility in cattle. The affected cases fail to express the behavioral signs of heat. Anistress is a period of reproductive insufficiency characterized by the reduction in hypothalamic secretion. It is anistress in cattle and uh, along with inadequate doses of nutrition. Cows in anistress show no heat activity because the process of follicle development does not lead to ovulation. Pituitary LH levels are so dramatically reduced in the anistress. Lack of follicle growth is seen by the virtual decrease in ovarian steroids in peripheral circulation and progesterone and estradiol secretion is also undetectable. The anistress syndrome is observed in cattle during gestation period, lactation period and during off-breeding season. The signs of anistress are very similar to those with the missed hits. Causes Nutrition, reduction in the body condition score, suckling calf, lactation, dystopia, breed, age, month of calving and debilitating diseases and uterine pathology. Main causes of anistress are inappropriate feeding after calving, poor heat detection, housing, suckling, poor condition at calving. And even the poor body condition are of high risk of anistress. Classification of anistress. Classification of anistress is done by Roberts and can be classified mostly in the buffaloes. He classified the anistress into two types. Type 1 female with normal corpus luteum and type 2 with no functional corpus luteum. Type 1 is mainly seen during pregnancy and type 2 is mainly seen when ovaries are inactive or inactive. Type of anistress. True anistress. In this condition there is an insufficient pituitary stimulation that causes the development of ovarian follicles, causes insufficient energy or bad nutrition, any chronic disease such as parasitis etc. A deficiency of iron content such as copper, magnesium and vitamins. Most of the true anistress cases are due to the nutritional deficiencies. Anistress associated with the persistent corpus luteum. In the regular Easter cycle, when the pregnancy does not happen, the corpus luteum degenerates and another cycle initiates. In certain cases, corpus luteum continues and leads to anistress. There are four types of anistress associated with corpus luteum. Earlier embryonic death, mummification of the fetus, fetal softening and pyometron. Anistress is associated with the cystic ovaries. In this case, one ovary is enlarged due to the excessive development of luteal tissue. And sub-estress, the cow has normal cyclic activity but it is observed in estress due to the weak or absent estress behavior or insufficient observation. Treatment. Treatment is based on improvement of energy status or hormonal treatments. In energy status, optimum nutrition during transition period and early lactation. And in hormonal, along with the energy supplements or reduced uh, suckling stimulus may lead to stimulate, stimulate estress. One should apply hormonal therapy with caution because it is essential to correct management deficiencies first. Treatment should be matched to the type of ovulatory conditions. Type 1 and type 2 anistress treatment. Correcting the negative energy balance, a reduction in the length or elimination of dry period can attenuate NEB and reduce anistress. Hormonal treatment, controlled intravaginal progesterone releasing devices, intravaginal progesterone insert followed by an injection of hormones such as quinine, chlorionic, gonadotrophin, estradiol and PGF2-alpha, timed insemination protocols and for type 3, progesterone, gonadotropin releasing hormone, PGF2-alpha treatment and subsequently timely inseminatory to treat persistent ovarian follicles. For follicular cyst, agents such as GnRH that induce the release of LH, if cysts become luteinized, luteal regression must be induced with PGF2-alpha and for type 3, for estrus, uh, PGF to alpha to terminate the life of the CL and initiate estrus cycle. And thank you. I would like to thank uh, Mukarta sir for giving this opportunity and I would like to thank everyone for watching. Thank you.